What is it? What is that? I don't know. I don't either. <laughs> it looks. It sounds very chic, though. Um, I did warn you guys about these. They are from Plow and Hearth, and they always go quickly. This is a 19-inch metal flower wall art. When we we'll see Nancy holding it, and you'll get a better idea of the size of it. Um, it there's a little hanger on the back of it, so if you want to hang it, obviously you can. They're metal daisy flowers, and they're 19 and a quarter inches in diameter and three quarters of an inch deep. So that means that they have this dimension and flow to them. Nancy's showing you right now what that's all about. We do have it on two easy payments of $10.63 with no reorder. So we're not gonna get these back in again. Blue or yellow are your choices. Is that one the yellow? This one's the yellow, so pretty. This is by Plow and Hearth, which is a company that's going to give you all those really cool items for outside your home to help you add beauty, something distinctive. I love their metal wall art, so do you, because it's just an easy way to add that pop of color, something different. And you know, you're gonna decorate some vertical space that often is forgotten. So we have our two choices up here behind Antonella and I. Um, they are, as you have the Here's blue. the blue, mm -hmm. and that has like little kisses of lavender that dance around the tips of the flowers. You'll have primarily done in this beautiful, almost blue steel sky. And then in the center, there's this warm bronzing, um, almost like a starburst effect that happens in ombre into the blues. It's so pretty. And then um, it kind of looks like a dahlia to me, just yeah. really icy blue. And then your other one is your yellow choice. And that to me just says sunshine. It looks like a bright yellow daisy, yeah. same kind of burnishing that's going on in the center, all those layers of metal that create lots of texture. And then it kind of goes out into that pretty orange. So you can see just even the lights on the studio are shining on it. So you can imagine this out on your garden, on your fence, you know, maybe on yeah. a gate, a garden gate, but also right behind me just here. Just real quick though, let me give you a quick oh, update on sure. that yellow. Kevin, I'm so sorry, sir. What did you say? One more time on that yellow. Um, 150 in the yellow. Wow. And that okay. one I think is more limited than the blue. Is that correct, sir? That is correct. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, what were no, you saying? No, that's okay. So the one right behind me on the door shows how if you want to use this instead of a wreath, I love this mm -hmm. idea. Because very often it's so welcoming to have a wreath on your door. But if you're someone like me that has a storm door, oh. or maybe you even have a screen door, it's kind of hard to put something that has some depth to it. Yeah. And so this is gonna fit nicely. It's just a good size. It looks like kind of a wreath size. But I'll show you again that this is very narrow. It's got a very narrow profile, so don't worry about this being on a door or maybe you even have a hallway door that you just love to have something on mm -hmm. hang it like you would a wreath but you don't want people to kind of hit it this is a really great option oh uh, and I meant to show you oh yeah here's how you hang it there's like this little uh, keyhole right here on the back so very easy to do and yes. honestly indoor outdoor if you, oh, you yes. know yeah if you want to do a baby's room with flowers or you want to like spruce up a little girl's room or your own any any room that you want these are beautiful if you get a couple of them right and just I love kind it. of yeah inside or outside love what we're seeing there yeah and it's perfectly fine to use outside plow and hearth made sure that you've got something that can withstand the elements so feel comfortable that you can put this on that she shed you can put it out near your um patio like i said maybe on that back um beautiful you know fence that you've got if you have a picket fence or a cedar fence mm -hmm. would be really pretty on a gate oh, so yeah. you know you can use this There's outside but ways. and it's a it's plow and hearth mm -hmm. that's something that you can be proud of and you know that it's really good quality yes you know it's going to withstand the test of time the elements in your life it's beautiful and to get this at a low clearance price is slamming I mean we're talking about two payments of ten dollars and sixty three cents just remember though I don't want you to get one home and then say you know what I'm going to go and get another one and then it's sold out because we're not going to reorder these. The best thing that you do is get how many you think you're really going to need. Be honest with yourself. And then if you want to return them, you can. Or return one, return two, whatever you want to do. Just get as many as you think you're going to want. Because typically, if you go to Plow and Hearth, it's, if people hear that and they think, ka-ching, 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 expensive. So this is a steel deal. It is, and you know, it's a wonderful relationship that Plow and Hearth has with QVC. So we want you to experience things that are really cool, unique, mm -hmm. something different. And I do love when you were saying get a number of them because look at how pretty it is up there, yeah. even just with the two. Uh, so you could decorate with two different colors. Maybe you'd like to have. I'm gonna interrupt you. In the yellow, there are only 100 left. Oh, wow, okay. And that's it. 
Okay. Okay. So such a pretty, um, you know, combination to have the two different colors. Mm -hmm. They each are very unique, but maybe you're drawn more to the cool colors. So you like the blue one with the purple. The, the yellow one definitely has that warm kind of sunshine feel to me. Yeah. Definitely, um, you know, looks like daisies. And so, I, but I really do like them together. Yeah, I do too, or, or kind of, I love how you did the blue, then the yellow, then the blue, the way that all flows and moves. It's just lovely, whether it's gonna be indoors or outdoors. And just remember, it's plowed heart. The entire piece is metal. Yes, When you it look is. at it from the side, you still see the color, you see the dimension. Good night, is that, is that the tornado hitting us? Golly, have mercy. Aren't we supposed to go to lie or tape TV and we're supposed to take shelter? No, not today. All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, here, Annie here's Annie, what Annie, I'll do. Yeah. If you see I'll shelter. <laughs> not even funny <laughs> all right <laughs> Jeez well, Louise. anyway so I, I love you Angela. i love you too i love you <laughs> folks i always have let me see this okay real quick. yep it's made um, out of metal so it's really well done thing. yep so you can kind of adjust these if you want to can't you a little, a little bit. bit yeah look at that side print that's what i want you to see that just um Blooms, Isn't that pretty right see there it is and then there it is yeah and lots of dimension different metal. layers one two three four layers of metal yeah that yeah. is beautiful it's like this platter of sunshine yeah. and in fact i actually hung this on um a trellis there was uh -huh. no flowers growing on it during the winter time i put this up so i had some color to look at during oh, the winter that's smart yeah okay they said don't wait on the yellow now okay okay all right I, <laughs> Nancy, you have to go. I, I do. Oh I take my you gosh. <laughs> All right. Well, be careful out there. Be careful out there. Okay. Oh, I'm staying over. Are you staying over? Yeah. yeah. In the morning. Until the morning. Yeah. Well, I, you have to. I mean, they're yeah. looking tornado. We don't get those here. That's kind of I'm scary. leaving those up on the wall. I got to call the kids. Make sure they're all right. Oh, they're sleeping. You know they're, they're, <laughs> they're having a party. Are you sure. kidding me? My, you know my kids. 